What's up, mobile gamers? It's Johnser Gigs, and we're here with a late night video. Uh, maybe not for you guys because I'm gonna try to post it in the morning, but it is late for me. Uh, I just got off work and I wasn't able to make this video because it seems like I always work on the Wednesday that they drop this. Um, so unfortunate for me, but it is an Aletta skin. And honestly, I was really excited for this skin, but then I saw it was an Aletta skin and now I'm kind of on the fence about it because as you guys know, I suck with Aletta. So we're going to go ahead and grab this skin real quick. Really, really cool animation. It reminds me of like the old school, like Halloween costumes where if you didn't have enough money, you would just basically make your own. And it's really, really awesome. I just wish it was for another hero or if I was better at Aletta. I think that I would really like this skin if I was good with Aletta. And unfortunately, as you guys know, if you watch the channel, I am not. So this is the KO Fizz we're gonna use. It's the black hole. I feel like it fits with the, the space theme. We've got the rocket ship. This is very, very similar to the rocket ship one you get with Gloria. Let me show you guys that real quick. You get a, a gun, and then I thought there was another rocket ship one. Um, there is another space themed one. That's what I was thinking of. And I'm not really a fan of it. And I don't think I'm a very big fan of the hollow poster either. It's looking kind of odd. And it's a plane, not a spaceship, which is very weird. And we're gonna go ahead and look at the skin now. I don't know if it's a very... Maybe it isn't spa a spaceship. It's kind of... It's called Echo Elite. It's got a spaceship symbol on it, and... That's what it reminds me of, honestly, you guys. So, we'll go ahead and select it here. Oh, now that is cool. Alright, this is, is a good skin. I am kind of on the fence about it, but now that I'm seeing it... On her, I'm really, really liking this skin. I know a lot of people are probably going to say that it's kind of lame. And I can totally understand that. But, like, look at this. It's got, like, the... I don't even know what you would call that. Like, is that a is that a glue gun type of nozzle on the end? It's got a gear on it. It's made completely out of cardboard along with uh, kind of one of those... looks like a bendy straw. Is that what that's supposed to be? Let me know down in the comments or... Maybe it's like some sort of a filter of some kind. I'm not really even sure. I really like the way the guns look though. I think they kind of get um, very carried away with the guns. And like they just, it's a little much. Even that one's a little too much. But the gun on this skin is very, very nice. Very simplistic. It's just a piece of cardboard. And I think that's what I like about it. So we're going to go ahead and keep looking at this skin here. She does just have regular um, leggings, I think. They've got a blue stripe. Um, not really anything to write home about as far as the bottom half of her skin. It's just leggings with the shoes right there. They've got some yellow on them, which is nice. So basically what we're going to do is we're just going to go ahead and do this. And look at this skin like it is. Because that is a cool select animation. She does have like some arm stuff on her. I don't even know. Whoops. Don't even know what you would call those. They're kind of an odd piece of material. But she did make her costume out of cardboard. It does have a head headgear piece. And I think the, the box needs to be a little bit lower on her. I think if it's lower on her... And it wasn't as big on the forward part. You can see how it goes like through her whole body. It's just as big as she is, basically. Um, and I don't know how I feel about that. I think that's a lot of the reason people are going to not like this skin. Or they're not really sure if they want to get it. And that's because it's just not very good. You can see she has like a... It's got like a, a wheel of some kind. Like a... Like one of those hatches that you can open in old school space movies. It's got a rocket ship on it, which is cool. And it's also got some some buttons on it. A green and a red. So I honestly don't know what this skin is in reference to. If you guys do know what it's in reference to, let me know. Um, I'm thinking it's just um, 
one of those skins that's like, oh, back when you used to make Halloween costumes or or build a fort out of boxes and stuff like that. And it reminds me of the box that Gru wore on his head in Despicable Me. It's kind of almost like a minion-esque skin. Like that's what it, it brings to my mind when I look at it. So I don't know what you guys think. Let me know down in the comments. Obviously most of you guys just care about that part, but um, I, I like the space theme. And I really can't wait to see what the effects are like. So we're gonna do the select animation here and I'm gonna shut up while it plays. Yeah, all right, now I'm really confused. I don't know what that was. I mean, she just kind of dances and I'm not really sure what that's supposed to be. Cause she like poses in like a robot pose. So is she a space robot? Is that what this is supposed to be? Let me know down in the comments what you guys think. I, for the life of me, could not tell you what that's referencing. So if it's referencing some movie I'm too young to have seen or a movie I'm too old to have seen even, let me know down in the comments. I really like the skin as far as the creativity that they put into it, I think is really, really cool. Uh, we're going to let the idle animation play and then we'll jump into a match real quick. So that looks like, oh, okay. That's just the idle animation. Some of them have like, they push their glasses up for a pose or something like that. Okay, her hand turned into a, a space worm type thing. If you guys have seen Steven Universe when he is talking about the cluster, that's what that reminded me of there. So definitely some, some Steven Universe vibes and a little bit of, like I said, that Minions vibe. So we'll probably put that in the thumbnail depending on how many cool poses we can get from the skin. You know I always love putting in poses. But we're going to play ranked, and I know a lot of you guys are thinking, how could you? Like, how could you play ranked when you're playing Aletta? And the truth is, normally I wouldn't. If I'm going to play Aletta, she, I'm just not very good with her. You know, I've almost got up to the full stadium track, and I decided, you know what? I can lose all three games, and I won't derank. And everyone has the event shields right here on the side here. See, it says all the rules. I'll let you guys read that real quick. So you have two shields, which means you can rank up. And if you are about to rank up, it'll obviously keep the shields. But if you derank, right, if you're going to derank or you lose a match, you won't lose that um, gem slot. So you can see you have the gems at the top of the platinum rank. I got four of them. And I have enough shields that I can basically lose all matches that I play and I won't have to worry about it. So we're going to go ahead and see if we can grab her. I don't anticipate very many people picking her because I really honestly don't see her in any of my lobbies. So maybe that'll change. Maybe I won't get to her in time. We'll see. Hoping that I can grab her real quick. All right, no problems getting her. And she just she just looks silly. I think it's because it's a box. It's a box that's not very big either. It's very high up. It makes her look like she has a very small neck and a very big body. And I think that's probably the main reason why a lot of people are not going to like this skin. Um, I know a lot of people that are content creators are basically gonna pass on this skin. But I personally, I really like it. I think if it was a little bit lower, or if the box was longer, if that makes any sense, that would, it would really lend itself. Oh, it does look very good. I did not hear what she said. We're going to go ahead and come back here and get the hollow poster. I actually kind of like this hollow poster, not going to lie to you guys. Um, it's better than the iris one, I think. It's definitely up there in the top holo posters. 
And we are attacking, which I have mentioned before, I don't like attacking. Probably wouldn't have chosen Aletta, but... Um, ooh, look at that! Oh, I like... And the sound? Alright, I'm gonna shut up and I'm gonna dash real quick, alright? Are you guys ready? So that's what it sounds like. Very, very cool. And like I said, I'm no good with Aletta, so we're gonna basically... Just kind of jump in and out of the of the fray here, and I I already don't think Alette is very good in general. I think she's probably one of the weakest of all of the flankers. But um, we're gonna just go ahead and use the abilities and stuff and do our best because our team is getting their butts kicked. Did get the ruby. See if we can't get the the shell. Is she going to go for the health pack? Okay, she didn't. Um, we're going to go ahead and push the payload. Like I said, I'm totally fine with just not doing as much as I usually do. Um, we're just going to push the payload and wait for our team to help us out. Oh, whoops. I tried to double jump. Oh my gosh, I'm so dumb. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Um, Yaw is very much so a better flanker, and so is Shell. I think Aletta's... You know what? Elena might be the worst flanker. Let me know down in the comments uh, what you think. A lot, obviously, a lot of you guys think that Aletta's like really, really good, which is very interesting. But there we go. We're gonna go ahead and get the ult on him. It's very interesting that she kind of followed me there. Ooh! Oh, one shot from the skatey. And there we go. The Gatlin's just kind of slow motion and coming up. She's going to die to the yaw, unfortunately. Oh, she had her ultimate. Okay. So the ultimate's the only reason she did not die. Uh, yaw is a very good counter to um, Gatlin because you just put her shield up and then you, you're you going to lose the encounter for sure. Oh, wow. Yeah, like I said, you guys, sorry that the gameplay is very, very minimal. <laughs> I just suck with her, honestly. That's just... Let's just get it out of the way. I suck with Aletta, okay? I think if I was on PC, I'd love her. She's very strong on PC. But I just... They have a lot of far-range heroes that can reach me. Um, we'll wait for the Ruby ult to close. Yeah, if you look at that, they just killed like three of our people. So, essentially, I'm facing down all of the enemy team members as Aletta on my own. And I just don't think that... I'm definitely not good enough to do that. Uh, we'll go ahead and rewind real quick. I just think that you have to really rely on Aletta's ultimate to be able to get some of these kills that you usually... Oh, like I was behind the wall for sure on that one. Um, I think you have to rely on her ultimate way too much. Um, I think they should give her back her heal. And I think that the, the amount of dashes you can do is very nice but I just wish they went further because it's very easy to just follow it with your eyes and then you don't have to even do much um, we'll see if we can go ahead and sneak up on the, the ruby I do wish that it would have like a proximity in, built into the yeah there we go I mean a bad team's a bad team you guys I can't really do too much about that um, even if I was very, very good at Aletta, I don't think we would have done very good in general just because of how bad the team was. Yeah, I mean, five is the lowest number of deaths on our team, and I actually almost got the highest amount of kills. So, if you think that's bad, just look at how bad everybody else did with the good heroes. Um, I don't like playing Aletta, actually. I think if I wasn't a content creator, I would skip on this skin just because it's an Aletta skin, and I hate saying that. You know, I like to give you guys positive stuff, but Aletta is just one of those heroes I have never been good with. So feel free to just demolish my gameplay in the comments because I just am very bad with her. And it's just difficult to move like that on mobile. I don't know about you guys, but my thumbs hurt from trying to play Aletta for, you know, if I was to go like two or three matches my thumbs will start hurting just because I have to, you know, move my thumb, hit the button, and then you have to do that over and over again. Um, it hurts your thumbs, for sure. So, all right, we finally got into a match. 
And I think I'm going to take back what I said early, earlier. Um, I do like this skin, you guys. I think it's really cool. I just wish I was better with Aletta, honestly. I think that's a lot of what's going on. Is if I was good with Aletta, this would be awesome. I'd love this skin. I'd play it all the time. But unfortunately... I'm just not very good with Aletta. Like, very... Not very bad, but like not very good either. Um, we're gonna go ahead and just not... Oh my god, three tanks? Yeah, we're toast. Unfortunately, because I have so little health, I just think a lot of the other heroes do better damage when they're flanking, you know what I mean? I think that um, if I was a different- if I had more damage for Aletta, I think I would like her a lot more, but I find that all the other heroes are more comfortable for me in the damage category. I don't know how you guys- oops, whoops, rewinded there. Um, not sure how you guys feel about that. I know a lot of people have bad experiences with Aletta's because they're like super strong or whatever. Um, let's see, what are you doing over there, Fade? Ooh, did we get our ultimate off? Oh, I don't think we got it off. I think we would have got at least one kill there. Yeah, we didn't get it off. That sucks. Like I said, I think her ultimate is not near as strong as it used to be. Oh, did she- oh, she got me just from crossfire on her three cards there. I think we would have done pretty good. Would have got behind them there. So, they're really doing some work with these these tank heroes for sure. Oop, who is that? Oh, that's a glory? Yep, we're not- ooh, ooh, ooh. Get the jukes, get the jukes on them. Ah, oh, dude, I almost got her, you guys! Oh my god, I almost got her. Damn it! Oh my god, I... Oh, that would have been so nice for the video. R.I.P.'s in the chat. R.I.P.'s in the comments. R.I.P.'s all over. I almost got that Gloria. Oh, that would have done so much for my confidence. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and... Get the ult in there. And then we'll see if we can... Back up. I don't know where the Gloria is. Oh, I cannot believe that that hit me. Okay, get the get the. Oh, get the, oh. okay. We traded. We traded. We traded. Ooh. All right. And if we trade, that's a win in my book, you guys. I know I never play Aletta, so a lot of you guys are probably very upset with this gameplay. You're like, what is Aletta really that bad? And the answer is no. I just suck. So you saw there. I can't even use it to get up um, just a little ramp you know what I'm saying okay are you gonna chase me oh you're chasing me thank you oh my gosh get out of here I'm not actually terrible I just suck drop that off and Ooh, whoa that was a very interesting bounce I did not expect that uh, we'll probably call it this game Ooh, are we gonna get there in time get there get there get there Oh, nice, the Gatlin pulling through. Get get some damage on the Gloria. I think we might have a chance to kind of... Oh, did we... Oh, we're missing the jump? Oh, there's the Fade coming to get us. Oh, I jumped right into her... Oh my god. Nice placement, dude. Whoever that is is very good with Christina. It doesn't help that I'm playing one of my worst heroes, but we're going to try to still do some good damage and help the team out because I don't want to just be dead weight even though I pretty much am. Um, feel really bad, honestly. You guys tell me I throw a lot of my games by doing this, but um, this is even worse because I'm not even good with Aletta. At least with somebody like Gloria, I'm actually good with her. But now that we have an Aletta skin, it's like... Ooh, contested? Are we dropping down? Yep, they have a Jabali. Okay. Get the kill on the Jabali. Ooh, did they have a Gatlin? They have a Gatlin. Ooh, drop the ult. 
Yep, she has a... Oh, she didn't have that labula, I'd have got her, you guys. Mark my words, I'd have got her. That labula is the only reason she lived that. Okay, we need to go help out the... The, the Gatlin... Oh, the Gatlin is... Ooh, nice kill. Somebody got the kill on the... Ooh, can we get the kill on the Gloria? Nice, alright. Oh my gosh, see, I can't even... I can't even jump up the... Oh my god. You guys... Oh, stop laughing, it's not funny. Alright, I really do try, you guys, I promise. Uh, at least with Aletta. The other heroes I'm just good with in general. Um, ooh, are we gonna grab grab the kill on the, the Gatlin? Get the rewind on him? Boom! Look at that, dude. Alright, I I don't suck. I, maybe I just need practice with her. Let, just don't, don't rip me in the comments too... F oh, yep, yeah, there you go. Don't rip me in the comments too much, you guys. I, I, I just don't practice with her. Uh, that's all it is. Just rusty. I used to be very good with Aletta when the game first dropped. Uh, back when she actually was... Is that a Diggy? It is a Diggy. Whoa. What an interesting pick. And no more Christina, which is actually perfect for me. We're going to win this game. All right. All right, we're going to jump behind the Jabali. Helped out with the, the Gloria. That's the game, you guys. Oh. Oop. Slow motion on the Diggy. Get out of here. My skin is better than yours. Check that out, you guys. We just ranked up. And we got the shields from the event. That is awesome. I think I'm just rusty with you guys. Uh, I know that a lot of people don't like the skin. And for me, it's that I'm just not good with Aletta. The skin is phenomenal. I mean, look at the banner. It is so nice. It actually really fits well with the Gloria skin that has the space theme. So definitely use that for the Gloria one. I think this is a definitely a buy. If you're an Aletta main, for sure, this is a must get. And, you know, even if you're just looking for some fun... This skin's very, very cool, very quirky and unique, and it has a lot of stuff the other skins maybe don't have. And I mean that in a good way. I think it's a really cool skin. Uh, I think if I was better with Aletta, it's A tier, easily. The problem is, I don't have a lot of practice with her, and I'm not very good with her, so that's unfortunate for me. So, definitely... Leave a like on the video, you guys. I think this is a cool skin. Very underrated. I think people didn't really give it a chance when they saw it. And they were like, oh, that's the next skin that's coming next season? I'm not really a fan of that. And, I mean, just look at this. Oh, just that animation alone is enough for me to get this skin. I would have gotten this skin if I wasn't uh, a YouTuber, probably. Just because it's so unique and so cool. And I really wish I was better with Aletta. I should start playing her more. Uh, let me know if you guys want to see... Like, a list of my worst heroes would definitely have Aletta on it. Even though she's pretty high up. Um, I think Vincent's one of them. Victor's one of them. So, there's definitely some heroes I'm not good with. That we can put in some future videos for you guys. So, let me know kind of what you want to see. Um, and if you think... If you guys think that this skin is just bad... Let me know down in the comments, and then also if you're like, uh, you just suck with Aletta and that's why you didn't like it at first, well, that's fair too, and you can totally tell me that, because I definitely need to practice with her more. I think that, um, I kind of give it unfairly to her, because I'm not good with her, and I haven't really met anybody that's been, like, so good with Aletta that I'm like, oh wow, an Aletta? For the most part, I never have a problem with Aletta's. I think Yaw is honestly one of the ones that I'd have more of a problem with just because of how, uh, s like, sneaky she is. And Aletta's never really been that for me, so... Never really been threatened by her, and that's why I don't really think she's very good. Is because I never have to worry about an Aletta. So, I know you guys will flame me in the comments for the bad gameplay and for the words about Aletta not being strong and stuff like that, but... Honestly, just let me know what you guys think about the skin, because... I think it's really awesome. I'm definitely going to be rocking it and playing a lot of more. And I mean that in general. I'm going to try to get better with her. Because I want to be able to give you guys good gameplay with all of the heroes. And I think this skin definitely deserves that good gameplay. So 
Hopefully you guys enjoy. See ya on the next one.